Now Sessions. No scoring yet from him, but that's likely to change. And there's the pass to Carmelo. Shot clock at six. That's good from Sessions on the assist by Anthony. Sessions has got the first basket of the second half here for the Knicks. Sessions against Augustine. There's a screen by Modi Yunus. Ariza has the open look. Off target with his three. Their rebounding has been off the charts today, guys. Reason number one this game is out of hand. Exactly, Clark. Their lead is not surprising given their advantage on the backboard. You know, there's no better sign of how efficiently a team is operating than their assist numbers. And theirs are fantastic. Just beautiful when they play the game like this. Now here is Augustine from deep Harden. The basket is good. The assist from Augustine. Augustine's got his fourth assist in this one. Sessions against Augustine. And Sessions kicks to Anthony. And they come right back with their own three-pointer. Anthony's got 11. That's three of four here to start the half. Howard setting the pick for Augustine. Rebound by Anthony. Anthony's got five rebounds tonight. That's one for their first four to start the second half. Here's Ariza. And there's the whistle fouled hard on the shot. He'll go to the line. Looking at the numbers for Trevor Ariza, he has eight points, and he's got two baskets from out in three-point land. <laughs> and I'm sure they'd like to get a few more of those out of him. It's his first trip to the line. Trevor Ariza taking two shots. First one falls for him. Ariza hits them both. The Knicks leading by 11. Here's Anthony, and he takes the fantastic lead pass up strong for the slam. And, and nobody, guys, among the defenders stepping up to challenge him on that drive to the 10. And, Greg, he says thank you very much and <laughs> sails in for the flush. And those are the kind of sequences that tell you why the score is what it is. Way too many shots in close, and he's got to get his guys to cut that down in terms of points in the paint. Clearly the reason for the timeout, Greg. I mean, he wants his guys to toughen up inside and start protecting the rim. has some information for us Doris thanks guys I was able to hear Kevin McHale coaching his team during that break he said their plan was run their offense through James Harden coach reminded his guys that he is the centerpiece of their offense and he's the one they want with the most freedom to operate clearly some adjustments there had to be made because the time left for a comeback is quickly running out Kevin over to you all right Doris now here is Howard and Harden hit the stuff and a sturdy screen set for him that time. And he doesn't fool around just straight to the rim for the finish. No way for his man to get around that one. That's that's for sure. No chance, Kevin. I mean, the screen was in the right spot. His feet were set. He would have had to go straight through him. And that's not legal.
just over two and a half minutes gone by here in the second half. Here's Hawkins. Nice move. And so he draws the foul on the shot on trip to the line to shoot two. This is his third trip to the free throw line in the game. That one is off. Good on the second free throw. Just over two and a half minutes gone by here in the second half. Sessions against Augustine. There's a screen by Modi Yunus. They grab their own miss. You know what? He's just stone cold right now. Really not sure if he's their best option offensively as they try to get back in this game. Tried to bank it in, but he misses. Rockets trail by 12. And here's Augustine. Howard with a screen on Hawkins. Augustine against Anthony. Shot clock at five. A three ball. Augustine, no luck. Well, he's building a house with those bricks. I mean, one reason is he keeps trying to force it up when he's defended well. Move the ball, share the sugar. It's blocked, and it goes out of bounds. Last touch by Moni Yunus. Jones checked in for the Rockets. Patrick Beverly comes in for DJ Augustine. And then for New York, Aaron Aflalo. He's checked in for Pazingas. Gordon comes in for Hawkins. And it's Calderon in for Sessions. Second half here, we're just over three and a half minutes into it. And Trevor Ariza is gonna pick up a foul here. That's foul number two for him. I mean, that's a tough break for the D. I mean, he took the hit and drew the whistle. Yeah, but he was late to get there, Greg, so the referee couldn't give him a free pass on that one. Corey Brewers checked in for the Rockets. Anthony kicks to Gordon. And count it. Two points with a chance for one more at the free throw line. Pretty much all of their buckets coming from inside the paint now. That's right. Five of their last six makes were on the interior. They've established their inside presence. Houston making a switch here. Barbosa's checked in for New York. They have made eight of their 12 free throws in this game. Free throw good, Gordon. In the third quarter with just over three and a half minutes off the clock. There's the dish to Howard. He kicks it to Barbosa. The feed to Jones, clock at four. From past the arc. Knicks with the rebound. Anthony dishes to Calderon. Anthony with the screen on Barbosa. Calderon kicks to Anthony. Oh, and there's the one-handed jam. He's their go-to guy, and when he shoots the ball like he has today, that's what the scoreboard usually looks like. They could use a big shot here to get this offense going. Sure could, Kev. I mean, too many empty trips. They need some points. Got a piece of it and stolen by a follow. He feeds it to Sanders. Pass to Calderon. Here's Anthony on the money from 12 feet away. Anthony's got 17 now. And an important part of every team's game, a look at the hustle stats for the Knicks. Their high-energy defensive effort has paid off for them, guys, with more than a few steals over the course of the ball game. And also, their second-chance points have been a story all night as well. That's just pure effort and hustle. The Knicks leading by 17. Calderon kicks to Gordon. In the corner, a Flalo with it. Calderon for three. And the Knicks hit again from deep. Sound offensively. Really no other way to put it here in the second half. There's no, really no comparison between the teams in terms of the way they've both shot the ball since the break. 
You have to like what we're seeing from Carmelo Anthony. He's definitely rolling offensively. You might not be able to stop him, but you've got to find a way to contain him. And the Rockets, with possession here, passes to Barbosa. There's the screen. And the rejection by Sanders. Kicks to Anthony. Some nice passing by New York here. And it's sent back by Howard. Here's Jones. They grab their own miss. And Anthony sends it back. And as it goes out of bounds, Houston able to keep the ball here. Here's Barbosa. The shot is off. Good work defensively by Anthony. The Knicks leading by 20. 16 feet away. Leandro Barbosa with the rebound. Calderon kicks to Anthony. New York, no good that time either. High quality shot, just a little off there with the release. And Greg, that has him S H H E shaking his head. Tough miss that time. <laughs> Clark. <laughs> Beverly up top, defended by Gordon. Beverly, the pass to Jones. Beverly against Gordon. Beverly dishes to Howard. That's tipped. Calderon with it. Barbosa picks him up. Howard against Anthony. Shot from 12. No good off the front iron. He operates well in traffic, but still, that's just a tough way to finish. Jones with the screen on Calderon. And Beverly kicks to Howard. Loses his man off the screen and lays it up and in. Howard's got eight points. Give an assist there, not for the pass, but for the solid screen set on the inside that freed him up and made the layup possible. Feeds it to Calderon. On the wing, Eric Gordon. Outside Anthony, clock at six. A three ball. Again, the miss by Anthony. Rockets trail by 18. Up the floor. And the bucket counts, and he's on his way to the free throw line. Try to make it a three point play. And I like how he puts himself in position there to finish on the break. Yeah, you know, that's what we call seeing and feeling the game. Excellent read of how that play was going to develop and where the ball was going. That's stuff that you oftentimes can't teach, Greg. The Knicks making a switch here. Roten's checked in. The Knicks leading by 15. Outside Gordon. Sanders sets the screen.